Hey guys, welcome back. Alright, so... This is how things are going. So, my thing doesn't say exactly when to do the genophage thing, but it does say to do the bomb pretty fast. So, that's how we're gonna do it. Uh, so we do Garrus and Jevik. And I guess we do have some additional add-ons now. I guess we already have some of this on. I'm going to say no to the scope now. Maybe rounds per magazine would be a better idea. Because I had the scope on the thing, it was the most worthless thing I ever could have imagined. Okay, is there anything good here? Well, it's a high velocity barrel that does 70% damage. Oh, we already have that one, actually. Why can't I put more barrels on? These are the questions I ask. Ironically, this now does more damage than the other one. Uh, yeah. I guess we might as well... I, we really don't need the ammo, but 50%. How much is 50%, though? It feels better than this one, but I don't know, man. I just don't know. I feel like unlimited... Okay, you know what? Just for fun, we're gonna do the concentration mod. Just to mix things up slightly. And there you go, power recharge speed is way better now. And I don't feel the need to change anyone else's things. And this one we're gonna get at some other point. Normandy shuttle, this is Lieutenant Victus with the 9th platoon. Do you copy? We hear you, 9th platoon. We're approaching the bomb site, Commander. Getting bounced around pretty bad. This is as close as we get, Lieutenant. Look for somewhere to set your platoon down. Copy that. Talk to me about this Cerberus bomb. It's not Cerberus, Commander. It's... Turian. What do you mean, Turian? It was planted centuries ago. After the Krogan rebellions. The bomb was a safeguard against another galactic war. Brutal, but it makes a certain kind of sense. Put the Krogan down hard if they tried anything. Makes sense. Couldn't trust the Krogan to play nice. But right now, we focus on disarming that bomb. Yes, but Cerberus found it. Detonation means all-out war between my people and the Krogan. Right. Where is it? Those buildings ahead. Cerberus brought equipment to dig it up. The 9th Platoon will cover your flank, Commander. With all this activity, the Krogan have to know something's up. Then we can't fail, Commander. Copy that, Lieutenant. <laughs> he held it. He held it like an assault Let's rifle. Alright. What the fuck is going on? Alright, I guess we can just do this. What is it with this artillery that never hits anything? Alright, well... Fucking for real, every time. Don't worry, Garrus is my back. That was actually pretty fun. Okay, they're hitting their own people now. Let's move, oh, I saw a grenade getting thrown. Where'd it get thrown from? Oh, that's good. We need to keep moving. Once we reach the bomb, I'll need to reprogram the trigger mechanism. Copy that. No trigger, no explosion. Uh, there's the incisor. Uh, that's the crap one, right? Probably is. I think it's the, the three-shot one. Yeah, well, how's that not a headshot? <laughs> oh, yeah. 
Alright, Garrus, shoot that thing. Actually, dude, we are doing a crap ton of damage. What the fuck happened? I, it must have been all the add-ons I've gotten in, like, the... All of a sudden, this rifle is just wrecking kids. Like, those are not headshots, and I'm still just wrecking kids. Well, apparently, uh, he does not care. I guess we don't really need the ammo upgrades, because we're maxed already on everything. Okay. Uh, also, that guy's just dead. Because I've been carrying around those am ammunition, uh... Commander, an exit on the left. I mean, he is actually right, it is on the left. Dude, can the, can the AI be, stop being so fucking helpful in this game? Holy shit. Now I'm gonna complain about that, now. As I said, either the useless or the mad. Pretty extreme, but those were desperate times. Iconic strategy. Control your enemies without them knowing it. Yeah, so even Javik likes it. It's fine. SMG heatsink. Good work, Lieutenant. Okay, they lined up. It's this Pierce. I think he needs his own Garrus. Pistol scope. Alright. Oh, dude. Pistol scope. Alright. We know what we're putting on. I'm getting a lot of Cerberus radio chatter. They're prepping for evac. I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> he did his best. But Garrus is just too strong. Cerberus is retreating! What ramp? Up here? No. Oops, I missed. I don't know why randomly their heads don't explode. I, I, am, do I one shot body shot things? Actually, that's a very good question. Because that would tell me if I'm missing the head. So next time I'm gonna try that. A planet killer, hidden under the ruins. It must have been far enough underground to stay hidden. Cerberus had to dig it out. I hope Victus knows what he's doing. We won't get a second chance. We gotta move, Shepard. Commander, we're entering the bomb site. Moving towards the control station. Roger that. We're on our way. Yeah, on top of the bomb. So we're going to be back with everything they saw. It was a mistake to allow us to get this one. Getting all these random mass upgrades. Okay, here's a random guy. No, I think he had a shield. Okay, I apparently can kill him for. Uh... Okay, well, I tried to do another roll to try and remain undercover, but uh. Apparently, I think just smokes me in like fucking ten seconds. We're nearly on top of the bomb. Cerberus will be back with everything they got. It was a mistake to allow us to the bomb. You stop telling me about my mistakes. I know my, about, about my mistakes. Also, that place had oddly no cover. Which is this thing doesn't even have fucking a ammo on. So it's actually doing less damage than it should have been. God, I hate the fact I have to put that on every, on every like time. Control schematics for automated turrets. No good now, but they might be useful later. Seven. 
We need to hurry. Uh. I'm at the control panel, Commander. Cerberus set up a firewall around the trigger mechanism to slow us down. I need to create a bypass. That'll take time. But like you said, no trigger, no explosion. You, they set up a firewall? Well, I mean, you're at the thing. You know, open up some ports or something? I don't fucking know. Are you sure you can disarm the trigger? Yes, it's old tech. I know what to do. Buy me a few minutes, Commander. I put my team at risk to get you here, Lieutenant. You better deliver. I know what's at stake, Commander. And thank you for making sure I get this chance. Just make it right, soldier. Look out! Commander! Focus on the bomb. We'll handle Cerberus. Nobody gets past us. Clear? Understood. Oh, shit. I do. I got that nice visor. It's great. Where are people coming from? Javik uh, doesn't care about grenades. He eats them for breakfast in his cycle. One after the other. They're sending everything they've got. Watch for more shuttles. Almost there. Oh, fuck. Stop grenade in. Oh god, not the fat list. Kind of want to spray it down. It's not spraying it. Ah, that's a very nice time to pause. Okay, I don't even have to do anything. Oh, it fucked wrong gun. Ah, uh, not that one. That's Javik. Ow. Alright. My teammates are going through some shit right now. I kind of would like to bring Gar Garrus back. Fuck. Tried to dodge. Okay, that was quite the position. He just died with his arms up. Oh. Nobody gets past us. Clear. You just throw a grenade at me through the wall. Time dilation lasts forever now. Close to it not lasting long at all. Oh. Holy shit, that combat roll. Alright, alright, we're doing that for now on. This is, we're playing fucking Kayla now. Fuck. Can I fire while it's going on though? I kinda can. It was, it was easier when I did this. <laughs> this is dude, this is hard. Now we're just being meme lords, I know, but no, I can't. Uh, it actually prevents me from doing whatever I want. Shuttles. 
All right, let's get saw these guys. I don't know where Javik went. It's slowed down though. Shepard, take that thing down now. I'm glad I get to slow down time for this much. I'd almost say that probably the thing on its back is probably the weak point. Oh, it's just dead, alright. Okay, they're shooting me through the fucking the wall, okay. That's why shield recharge is like super good now. Turn of the cutscene assault rifle. So why was this not the first thing he did? took a lot of casualties, Joker. The Primarch's son included. Understood, Commander. Joker out. He never hesitated. Whatever he was before, he'll be remembered for this. What will the Turians think about this, Garrus? Hard to say. Sacrifice and more is expected. He did us proud, but... we're a hard bunch to please. Living your life for the cause. Society first, platoon first, it's all just expected. He did what he had to do when it counted. Yes. Yes, he did. Good work on Tachunka, Commander. Stopping that bomb prevented the war between the Turians and the Krogan. We can't afford that kind of division right now. Joker said the Krogan are recovering the bomb. They moved in, won't allow Turians to send in recovery crews to help. Understandable. The situation is fragile at the moment. With Rex and the Primarch aboard the Normandy, you've got a situation brewing. We don't have a solid alliance between those two yet. Keep the peace, Commander. That's an order. Yes, sir. Pack it out. We couldn't risk another galactic war with the Krogan. The Genophage wasn't enough? You had to plant a bomb on my planet? The decision was made hundreds of years ago. So much has changed. Not enough to tell us about the bomb, coward. Hey! The Reapers are out there destroying the galaxy, and you want to fight about this? Primarch, you had a bomb on Tachanka. And Rex, in the Turian's place, you would have done the same damn thing. 
Shepard. It's over. His own son died today, making this right. Please, Commander. It's all right. Yes, fine. Shepard, you've made your point. We have stronger enemies to face. We do. <sighs> I understand your reservations before, Commander. But I hope you now understand the secrecy. You kept this a secret and then put your son in charge? He couldn't handle it. Yes. You're right, Commander. It was a mistake not to trust you. I know that now. My son, he died with the respect of his men. I wanted to thank you for that. His sacrifice will be recorded in the histories of the Ninth Platoon. Something any father would be proud of. Yes, sir. Again, Commander, thank you for ensuring my son died with honor. It's all a Turian father can hope for. But this is war. The time for mourning is later. Is there something you need? Despite everything, Primarch, I'm sorry for your loss. Thank you, Commander. And I know I'm not the first to lose their son to this war. Needless to say, I'm committed to stopping the Reapers. That's all. Of course, Commander. Turians pull another move like that, Shepard, and this alliance is off. Just bear with me, Rex. This is hard for all of us. I've got Reapers on my planet, a bomb that almost blew up my planet, and if those two fail, the Genophage to make sure we all go extinct anyway. I don't want to hear about who has it hard. Understood. Good. Now, is there something you need? That's it for now, Rex. Let's get back to work. Anytime. All right. Guess now we go do our rounds and talk to fucking everybody again. You hear we had the evac, another colony? We're losing a lot. Don't hear about the Reapers losing much. Well, Reapers don't have colonies. Neither does Cerberus. If they did, we could drop an asteroid on them. I heard what Victor's did. He was a brave man. I don't think I could... Uh again. I was going to say that I could never do that. But? But I was wrong. Being here, watching you, you've shown me what it means to serve in the Alliance. You're a good officer, trainer. Glad you finally realize it. Thanks. And not that I'm volunteering for bomb jump duty. I'd suggest sending someone who has armor first, if possible. I was saying that the, um, the galaxy map reacts to my presence, but not trainers. Look at that galaxy map. Do you know how many strategy games are built from that interface? You play strategy games? A few. Most are too flashy, though. I prefer chess. I have a set made from rose quartz and hematite back home. I like the feel of something solid in my hands. If I'm gonna play a game, I need something a bit more exciting. Well, I doubt it compares to lobbing a grenade at a charging Krogan. Few things do. But it also results in fewer broken bones. Commander. I'm just saying, I think she's a Reaper. It's the most likely uh, plausible explanation right now. Why else would it not react to her? The Turians will hold. Pound for pound, they're the best fighting force in the galaxy. Pound for pound is irrelevant, given the significantly higher mass of Reaper forces overall. That's why we're bringing in the Krogan. You gotta love the Turians. After they beat you down and sterilize you, they strap a big old bomb to your planet. You know, just in case you get uppity again someday. I'm just glad we disarmed it. Damn right. The Krogan are pretty tough. I'd rather it be Reaper asses getting kicked than not ours. Commander? What's new, Edie? Admiral Anderson reports that the Reapers on Earth are broadcasting orders. 
They are demanding human leaders into their superstructures in order to negotiate peace. Anybody aboard a Reaper is going to be indoctrinated. Exactly. This is a ruse to pacify the populace during that process. Citizens who are busy waiting are not busy fighting. It is likely that the governments of Earth will soon enact laws punishing those who attack the Reaper occupiers. Again, this will be done in the name of peace. Tell Anderson we're moving as fast as we can. Hello, Shepard. Oh, we need to get something new. Oh, we got a couple of chess piece things as well, I guess we can look at as well. But we won't go to deck five. That's, that's like Jacob's quarters or where Caden lives or, you know, there's always some place in, in, the, in, the, in the games where, which is like completely off limits. All right, let's see, nothing here. Ooh, weapon damage. I had shield regeneration before, I'm gonna take weapon damage. All right, what's better here? Oh, still a big fan of that. Uh, I'll take melee damage. And I'll take that one as well. Man, prefer not having the meme visor, but you know. You don't get to pick them all, I guess. Alright. I guess she's done. I guess she's just uh, kicked out of her home. <laughs> Until Morden leaves. Fuck. Alright. Have you ever got to catch someone in the shower? No. Catch Cortez in there. I'm sure that's how it went down. Say that again? The population of the colony world of Tyvor has been killed. I don't understand. The Reapers have been taking people alive. It was self-inflicted. When Reaper forces invaded, Tyvor's colonists detonated nuclear weapons inside their cities. Goddess. Their deaths would have been instantaneous, Doctor. Thank you, Glyph. That'll be all. Whoa, Tyvor. Busy? I have time if you'd like to talk. In fact, I could use the distraction. What's on your mind? How long it took the Reapers to eradicate the Protheans, and how long they'll need for us. It took them centuries to conquer the Protheans. We're not quite so widespread, but it would still take at least 100 years. It's selfish, but I keep thinking that if we fail... I'm only 109, Shepard. I could live to see the entire cycle come to an end. Only 109, huh? I know. It must seem strange to complain about a thousand-year lifespan. I used to think it was sad that most aliens live such short lives. Maybe it's not such a privilege to outlive so many. To witness so much death. Or you could keep fighting. I know. It's just... difficult. Watching you get shot at out there. We finally have other leaders on our side, but none will take us as far as you can. Sometimes I wonder how you do it. The Reapers would have been here years ago if I didn't. I wish motivating everyone else had been as simple. At least the galaxy always had you. Lucky galaxy. I certainly think so. Let's talk later, Shepard. I, I, I wasn't being a sweetheart. But I don't really give a fuck. Working on anything? I'm helping decode some of the Crucible's designs. Or trying to. Theoretical particle physics based on specialized base 12 mathematics aren't exactly my specialty. And Javik is his usual forthcoming self. I'd trade my last hundred years to resurrect even one Prothean scientist to help us. Base 12, that's all? I've never seen Krogan move with such purpose. It's a little terrifying. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for coming by. Uh, that's her get fuck off uh, thing. I guess there's an action, nothing else here. A new notification is available on the private I don't care. messages terminal. The private messages terminal is basically Jacob. Which is we don't talk to it. Or Caden. I'll assume you didn't know about this. My good friend wouldn't hide the fact that his people planted a doomsday bomb on my planet, right? Rex, I was just as much in the dark as you. Honest. <laughs> That's what I needed to hear. 
I'd be happy to give Krogan some lessons on relaxing. <laughs> and we'd be happy to feed you to a thresher maw. Rick's out. I don't know what Turian came up with the idea, but a doomsday bomb was damned ingenious. Embarrassing now, but ingenious back then. I'm glad Rex is taking this so well. My people haven't exactly treated his kind with charity over the years. Maybe later. Maybe later. Calibrations. Oh, there's always Javik. Shepard, Eve ready for travel to Tuchanka. Nice talking with you, Borden. We'll be here if you need me. I guess these Continuing two... Continuing to study Shroud in meantime. I guess these two don't have anything new. Something else, Commander? I guess I made you get it for nothing. Thanks for talking to me. <laughs> it's my pleasure, Commander. Over here. Uh, nothing. Uh, is there anything good here? Not really. I don't really want warp ammo, so... We'll just wait. No rush. It's not like I'm doing any more damage. And I think I've pretty much reached my peak, but, you know... I don't have either of the Black Widows. So we gotta try those at some point. Alright, I wonder if we can see Jacob. Jacob down there. Or James, sorry. Oh, I see that Cortez in there. Oh, he's gone. Your people would have made a good addition to our empire, Durian. You are cunning. Uh huh. And by addition, do you mean slave race? Subservient race. Right. Calling it that makes all the difference. But you did not go far enough. Either you should have detonated the bomb on the Krogan world, or used it as leverage. I think we were just trying to guarantee peace. A static mode of existence. Nothing changes, nothing struggles, nothing grows. On the upside, we all get to live another day. Nice chatting. There is some enjoyment in speaking to this Turian. His knowledge of war is formidable. Though he would be an even better marksman if he had four eyes. Back when the Krogan rebelled, I would have detonated a bomb that day. There was no need for the genophage. Yes? Hmm. Alright. wonder if Adams has anything. Nothing to report, Commander. I guess not. Alright. I'll head back up to the bridge. And, uh, uh, we'll see what's next, uh, fuck, you want me to tell you now? No, you'll see next time. Bye. Should wait, what's, what's in my, my Facebook? Nothing. Alright, bye. Spacebook, yeah, that's what it is.